case, if I don't get my meds on time when I'm supposed to, I can't function. Uh, I, I mean, I, my speech is affected, my walking is affected, uh, just my general well-being. When I went to the hospital previously, it was a real frustrating battle when, when you go and uh, you tell them when you're supposed to take your meds, they submit it to the pharmacy. The pharmacy comes up with this crazy schedule in times when they think you should take the meds or it comes from a computer who's giving these times. The constant bat battle all the time to fight to, to get your meds on time. It was a losing battle. This last time when the paramedics came to take me to the hospital, I pointed to the black bag and I said, there's a piece of paper in there, and I was referring to this reminder slip that says, I have Parkinson's and I must get my meds on time every time. And the paramedic took this with him to the hospital and get, uh, upon entering the emergency room, gave it to the triage nurse who saw it right away. So while I was in the emergency room at first, that, that time, I got my meds rather quickly, and the reason was they called my doctor, told him about this, and the doctor said, listen to what he tells you because he knows what he's talking about as far as getting the meds on time. Upstairs when they admitted me to the hospital and got on the floor and now going over with the nurse, I had to start all over again giving them this slip and really educating them and uh, the, the booklet about how to prepare for when you go to the, the hospital. The pages that were really most important and very helpful, pages 10 through 12, which talks about being vocal, being persistent, and assume that each person you meet has little experience with Parkinson's because that's true. Very few people I find in the hospitals have had a lot of experience in treating Parkinson patients. So when I wasn't getting anywhere and they wouldn't listen to me, I said, who's in charge? I want to see the person who's in charge and not the, not the, the floor nurse, but the nurse manager who's in charge of all the nurses of the hospital came to see me who got the head of the pharmacy upstairs to my room. And with that, after going through everything then, they got the schedule timed perfectly. And when I was in the hospital at that time, Every time I was supposed to, I got them on time and every time when I was supposed to. So now it's part of my permanent record. This made me aware of what I should do. It had made a lot of the healthcare professionals aware of what they should do in order to help the patients. So I think it's important for, for people who have Parkinson's to be aware of this and, and use it just like I have and I hope that they would and also for the health care, the doctors and nurses in the hospital.